Hey guys, what's going on? It's Constantine aka Smart Cloud Commentaries and um, thank you so much for the great response on the last uh, the State of COD video. Uh, I want to get like people that actually have like a, an influence in the game or something like that. I don't know. To, I want to get people to, I don't know, to agree with me I guess and see like what's wrong with that game. But um, anyway, thank you to everyone that subscribed and all that stuff. And um, this is some um, one in the chamber using the AS50 in a private match with some friends. And uh, here I, I wrecked. And uh, later on in this video, I'll give some tips for one in the chamber and how to play it. But um, before that, I want to do a lot of a, a couple uh, announcements and stuff like that. First of all, I want to start like a subscriber video submission day, like maybe Wednesdays or something. Uh, subscribers can send in gameplays, and um, all you have to do is have HD gameplay or or good quality gameplay and um, a good commentary, and I'll upload it. Uh, you can send it in to smartcodcommentaries at gmail.com and uh, just say like my uh, subscriber Wednesday submission and uh, if I like it I'll upload it. It doesn't have to be Call of Duty, it could be Battlefield, it could be anything you want. Um, and speaking of not being Call of Duty, I'm thinking of starting to upload games that are not Call of Duty like Battlefield 3 and um, maybe, uh, some, maybe some Minecraft, I don't really know. Maybe some uh, Happy Wheels and all that stuff. So I don't know. I just like I just like to get some recordings out there. But for the next few, the next this and two other gameplays or three other gameplays will be Call of Duty because I have them already recorded and on my hard drive. So I'll use those and then from there on we'll see. Uh, so I'll try to get some Battlefield Three stuff going. And uh, so yeah, I wanted to talk about um, some more ideas for bat for Black Ops. Uh, actually, I'll give some one of the chamber tips later on if I have some time. Um, a good thing, a really good thing that I think needs to come back is the Call of Duty points, the COD points system that Black Ops had, and combat training. Because the thing that, the thing that, um, that made Black Ops so beginner friendly, which would really help me, because I was, as you guys know in the last video, I was a complete beginner in Black Ops. I had never played any Call of Duty game before, except for like once or twice at a friend's house. And I played combat training for like, for at least... A couple weeks before I like started playing online really and I and that that helped uh, how that helped a lot and so um, I mean that that's why if you put combat training in the game like if there's combat training in Modern Warfare 3 you wouldn't need like all the be all the perks to help out the bad players because everyone would have like a sort of equal playing field I guess and uh, zombies definitely needs to come back because zombies is just amazing and survival mode is just a, a, a poor spin-off of zombies and um, uh, so yeah, that's that's what I think uh, needs to come back. COD points and zombies and um, what's it called? Wager matches and combat training and all that stuff needs to come back because it's it's just it's that's really the fun stuff that people like to play and attracts people to the game. And um, I mean, that's also you don't need to be like amazing. You don't need to be good to play combat training. You don't need to be good to play zombies. You can still have fun, as if whereas if playing on multiplayer, it's just it kind of gets frustrating sometimes, and you know it kind of gets aggravating. And people can like people rage quit a lot. Like I mean, I know I can I cannot play Call of Duty for more than I'd say probably an hour and a half tops before getting just just getting I don't know just pissed off at the game. I just have to stop, and I just can't play anymore. So I just so I think that's um, that'd be necessary to bring back and uh, some fun game modes, the COD points too are a fun thing to bet on, like you can't really bet on anything in Modern Warfare 3, I mean maybe you could bet like XP or something, but you can't really, I don't know, you can't get like demoted or something, I don't know. Anyway, on to some One of the Chamber tips, um, One of the Chamber is a super fun game mode, I recommend you guys try it, it's on the Free Fall Gunplay, and um, I know a lot of you guys don't like really, don't really like Call of Duty very much, um, so I'm just going to try to give some tips to the guys that do, and if you don't like Call of Duty, um, and don't like watching this gameplay, I'm sorry, but you can click off this video, I guess, and I'll talk to you as soon as possible. Um, by the way, guys, start sending in those submissions for Subscriber Wednesday. Send them in as soon as possible, and I'll start looking at them and upload them on Wednesday. Upload one of them on Wednesday. So, uh, yeah, one in the chamber, pretty much. The main thing about one in the chamber is you need to rush. You need to rush around, but you have to check your corners, too, at the same time. See, I'm, you see, I'm, I'm sprinting around here, um... Because the thing is, if you're in a corner and you're aiming down sights and you're waiting for people to come around, and if someone freaking just comes flying around the corner and you're already aiming down sights, if you play Call of Duty you know, and Battlefield 3, you'd know that if you're aiming down sights, the screen the screen look, the, the turn, your sensitivity goes down so much, it's so hard to lock onto target after you uh, 
accident. Like, I'm rushing around. That guy didn't even have his, his gun pulled up, and uh, I had mine up. I was ready. I shot him. So, I mean, here I went on a 10 kill streak. Actually, yeah, 10 kill streak, and then three death streak at the end. So, <laughs> but you got to realize that you got to take the shot, and if you missed a shot, it's it's just no one really cares. It's main thing about one of the chambers. You need to get lots of kills. Um, you need to get lots of kills in the beginning because you need to go kind of in the beginning. You need to play a little bit more. Uh, protective, but near the end, you need to start rushing around because people are going to be super cautious and they're going to be sitting in the corners and stuff like that. So, you need to rush around. You need to take the, take the shot. Don't be afraid to take the shot. And um, if people have bullets, you need to run side to side to side to side to side to side to side. You're going to see at the very end here what I was doing. And look at that bullshit. Look at that bullshit. I was knifing him. I, I was lunging, but I wasn't hitting him. And then he knifed me. I don't even know. Okay. But, <laughs> but yeah. So, um, that's about it, guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Please, a comment and the rating is so much appreciated. I love reading comments. Uh, it actually makes me super happy every time I get a comment. And you'll see in the very end here, look at me. Look at what I do to get this guy to shoot his bullet, and I, to his gun, and I didn't know he had two bullets. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Peace.